Hey guys, it's Doug Schrader with Timbercraft Tiny Homes in Gunnersville, Alabama. We are excited to show you guys a new home we just finished. This thing is great. This is based on our Denali model, but it is our Denali XL. It takes the Denali and just stretches it. We went from 37 feet long in the standard Denali to 42 feet long. We went to a 9.5 wide trailer, so we've got extra width, extra length. This home comes in at about 399 square feet. Um, just under 400 square feet of floor space. It also has a 65 square foot loft above the bathroom for storage, I'll show you in a minute. But floor space is almost 400 square feet, so it's a very spacious home. It's got the tall ceilings, it's got a lot of big feel to it. So uh, this is, of course is the living room when you come in. And uh, some really cool things we added to this one is the powered skylights. So these are made by Velux. They uh, open automatically, you've got a remote on the wall. Uh, you can set them on timers, they've got rain sensors, if it starts to rain they'll close. So it's kind of a neat, neat little feature to this one. Other than that, um, this is pretty much a standard Denali, just larger. So you've got the shiplap walls, you've got the stained wood ceilings, uh, the hardwood floors. These are our Sierra Pacific wood clad windows that we put in, uh, nice wood, fir wood doors. So those are all pretty much standard features in a uh, Denali. So now I want to show you the kitchen. The kitchen is awesome. So this kitchen is really large, guys. This, this XL provided a lot of space for a lot of really cool features. Really roomy, you can feel that. Really wide. You've got a couple different eating areas in this home. You've got a bar here that can be used for a couple place settings. You've also got a fold-up. Uh, bar here by the window. That'll hold a couple place settings as well. And the bar stools uh, can be moved over here if you'd rather sit here. The, uh, the appliances include a 24 inch gas range, four burner range with an oven, and this nice uh, summit refrigerator with freezer on the bottom, very nice and roomy. But also in this home we included a trash compactor and a dishwasher. So there's, there's no compromise here. This, this kitchen has it all. Nice quartz countertops. Um, this uh, client did really well on her color choices, I think. But uh, you've got a nice blue-gray lower cabinet, white upper cabinet for a little bit of contrast. This one has the farm sink also, which is really cool. And then a nice uh, sprayer type nozzle on there. Under cabinet lighting, we do those in our Denali's. And we build all the cabinets in-house, so everything is built furniture grade uh, with soft close hardware and things like that. So um, uh, the cabinets are built here and they're, they're custom. We can do about anything you want, stained, painted, uh, multicolors, anything you want. So, so uh, the house is heated and cooled with two uh, internal 9000 BTU mini split units. Um, this one here controls this area. And the whole house is spray foam insulated, so it's very efficient, easy to heat and cool. Above the refrigerator, you've got a small storage compartment here for cookie sheets, pans, things like that. The pantry in this home is right down the hallway. So you've got a nice uh, pantry shelves, a nice pantry here with a lot of shelves for your, for your pantry goods. So check out the bathroom, guys. This one's awesome. So down the hallway here, the bathroom is behind a sliding door, wood stained door. Step inside, and remember we're in a Denali XL, so we've got a lot of room. This is very spacious for a tiny house bathroom. This one has a few extra uh, features. A steam shower. Yes, you can get a steam shower in your tiny house. Um, has a steam head uh, below. The, the steam control is right there. It's a nice subway tile shower with the 
with the sealed glass. It's really a cool feature that this client asked for and uh, we're really excited to give her that. Also, the toilet in this is an incinerator toilet. Um, you can check those out, Incinolet. It's a composting type of toilet. And then beside the shower we have the linen shelves for your linens. A lot of space there for towels. This is also a um, ventilation fan and it's on a humidistat. So we have a humidity sensor that controls the humidity levels. It gets too high, the fan goes on, stays on for a certain amount of time. So that's standard in all of our Denali's as well. So over here in the corner, tucked out of sight, is the washer-dryer combo. You've got a set of doors, open and slide back. And there's your washer-dryer combo. Got a nice size vanity in this one, a little bit larger than normal. And instead of having the false drawer on top, we actually put a real drawer on the bottom, which gives you nice space there, along with the storage inside. It's got a quartz countertop as well with an undermount sink, and then the mirror to match. So the bedroom is upstairs, a, uh, a short flight of steps over the gooseneck part, which gives you a nice stand-up bedroom as well. There's storage stairs, uh, with drawers in each step. These are nice storage drawers, open and closed. So here we are in the bedroom. And again, this is large. This is quite spacious. It's got a king bed. So you don't have to compromise in a Denali XL. The king bed has walk around space on all sides. It also lifts up for a huge amount of storage underneath. So also you see there's the two skylights in the bedroom as well. And there is another control for them up, up here to be able to control these. You've also got two reading lamps beside your bed. And the uh, second air conditioner unit is up here as well. It's a 9000 BTU uh, mini split. Also you see in the corner here is the Lunos E squared fresh air uh, ERV system. Uh, that's standard in all of our Denali's. So there's two units, one on each end of the house, that work together to provide fresh air. Also across from the bed, it's a nice wall here for a TV mount. We've put a plug up here to mount a, a wall mount television across from the bed. And check out this closet. This closet's huge. So you've got two closet rods right here to hang your clothes. You've got a large storage deck over the bathroom which gives you a lot of room. So it's really a walk-in closet. Where do you get a walk-in closet in a tiny house? Also in the closet we have the electrical panel here and a plug-in here dedicated to a router system for wireless internet and things like that. That's why it's in here in the closet. So there will be a router station mounted here on the wall for her. So this is the video tour of the Denali XL by Timbercraft Tiny Homes. For more inspiration check out our website at TimbercraftTinyHomes.com to see more of the homes that we build. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our growing YouTube channel. Until then, see you next time. Thanks for watching.